Imagine this place, it's like one of the riskiest spots ever. No one has ever found anything here, what's happening? It's so unbelievable. More and more scientists are exploring the sea to figure it out. Our oceans are like the last big mysteries on Earth. Thanks to cool technology, we're learning new things every day. But some of the stuff we find is so strange that even after lots of research, we still don't get it. Today, let's dive into the sea's mysteries, from real proof of the Kraken to super creepy icy surprises. Here are 10 underwater discoveries that are just too puzzling. Number 1. The Immortal Jellyfish The profound contemplation of our mortality is a universal aspect of the human experience, making the pursuit of immortality a sought-after goal. Recently, scientists have delved into an unexpected source in their quest, a jelly-like creature drifting in the ocean. This extraordinary being is the Peratopsis dorni, often referred to as the immortal jellyfish. Discovered in the Mediterranean Sea in the 1880s, it measures a mere 4.5 centimeters, approximately the size of a pinky nail, featuring up to 90 tentacles and a transparent bell containing a vivid red stomach. The immortal jellyfish's unique ability to achieve what seems like immortality is fascinating. When threatened or injured, it undergoes a remarkable transformation, reverting to a previous developmental stage, a sort of biological reset button. This transformation results in the creation of a polyp colony, eventually producing medusa that are exact genetic replicas of the original jellyfish. While it might not align with our traditional notions of seeking a long life, the immortal jellyfish's survival mechanism is undeniably remarkable. Though the concept might not be directly applicable to humans, the sheer awe-inspiring nature of this creature leaves us marveling at the wonders of the natural world. Number 2. Moray Underwater Sculpture Park An experienced diver shared a chilling story with me. While on a summer trip to Granada, Spain, he faced a dilemma when he couldn't find a dive buddy. Despite the rule of never diving alone, he decided to rent a boat and explore the sea solo, just enjoying the underwater wonders. Suddenly, his heart raced and he felt a lump in his throat. What he encountered in Antarctica shocked everyone. In the distance, he spotted terrifying figures. At first, he thought it was just his imagination, but then he saw them again. The only time he felt such fear was when a sneaky shark approached him from behind. He debated whether to rush back to the boat and escape, but curiosity won and he decided to stay and see what was happening. As the figures approached, they became clearer, and then it hit him, they were sculptures. Human-sized sculptures adorned the seafloor, covered in algae and coral. Later, he discovered it was the Moray Underwater Sculpture Park, a famous diving spot in Granada. Despite the initial scare, a couple of good things came out of his trip. He stayed safe, which is always a win, and he learned a valuable lesson. Never go diving alone again. Number 3. The Bermuda Triangle When it comes to mysterious spots on our planet, none are more famous than the Bermuda Triangle, also known as the Devil's Triangle. It's a place where ships and airplanes enter but never come back out. The number of accidents there is hard to count because there are so many. Some say more than 300 vessels have disappeared in this cursed area. One example is the steamboat Mary Celeste, which went down near Bermuda under mysterious circumstances. And she's not alone. Experts say shipwrecks surround Bermuda. The term Bermuda Triangle was coined in 1964 by journalist Vincent Gaddis. According to him, it's the region between Bermuda, Florida, and Puerto Rico, covering 500,000 square miles of the Atlantic Ocean, supposedly deadlier than anywhere else on Earth. The first warnings about this area came from Christopher Columbus, whose ships got stuck in seaweed. But there are other theories, like sea monsters, aliens, and even portals to another dimension. Experts suggest the Gulf Stream in the Triangle can cause sudden weather changes, and it's a hotspot for Atlantic typhoons. Methane gas released from the ocean floor and disruptions to geomagnetic flux lines can mess with compasses. It's not just ships, airplanes also vanish. The mystery of the Bermuda Triangle might never be fully solved. Number 4. The Unknown 70 It's incredible how technology has propelled us forward in recent decades. We've sent robots to Mars and captured images of a black hole, yet about 70% of our oceans remain unexplored. Considering that our oceans cover a vast 70% of Earth's surface and play a crucial role in regulating temperature, weather patterns, and supporting life, it's surprising that we know so little about them. The exploration of the deep sea only began in the 1960s, and it faces significant challenges. 
One major challenge is pressure. At sea level, the air pressure on our bodies is about 16 pounds per square inch BSI. As we dive underwater, this pressure increases significantly. In the Mariana Trench, it's a staggering 1,000 times higher. Even when we send robot submersibles down there, they must be built tough to withstand such immense pressures and remain operational for thousands of hours. Another challenge is the corrosiveness of salty water. Most metals used in vessels and equipment need to be made from special types of stainless steel to withstand the corrosive effects of salt water. However, as technology continues to advance, we hope to unlock the hidden secrets of our oceans. What do you think might be waiting for us in the deep? Number 5. The Icy Finger of Death Every kid who has experienced winter likely remembers playing with icicles from trees or roofs. But have you ever heard of a brinicle? This intriguing phenomenon puzzled people for a long time, first observed in the 1960s but not fully documented until 2011. It resembles foggy claws of death descending from the surface to the ocean floor, freezing everything it touches, earning it the eerie nickname, Icy Fingers of Death At. This phenomenon occurs in the Antarctic Ocean, leaving a chilling trail of frozen ocean-dwelling animals in its destructive path. So, what exactly is a brinicle, and why does it happen? It's all about the freezing temperatures of the Antarctic. Salty water takes more time and colder temperatures to freeze than fresh water. When the ocean surface begins to freeze, it pushes out salt, creating an extra salty layer called brine. Below freezing and heavy, as it sinks to the bottom, the surrounding water instantly freezes, forming what's known as anchor ice. A brinicle can be as wide as 25 centimeters, and under the right conditions, it can grow several meters a day. Unfortunately, slow-moving bottom-dwelling creatures stand no chance against this icicle of death. Despite its otherworldly appearance, this natural phenomenon is a remarkable spectacle, though it may look like something out of a sci-fi movie. Number 6. The underwater river, waterfalls are indeed captivating natural wonders, drawing people in with their stunning visuals and the soothing sounds of cascading water down cliffs. But here's a fascinating twist. Did you know there's an underwater river and waterfall hidden in the depths of the Black Sea? In 2010, scientists exploring the Bosphorus Strait stumbled upon a channel exceeding 100 feet in depth, flowing with water. Even more astonishing, this underwater river boasted rapids and waterfalls at certain points with a volume 350 times greater than the River Thames. So how does this mysterious phenomenon occur? The Black Sea has some unique characteristics that make it possible. To unravel the mystery, let's trace the origins of the water. The Black Sea is replenished by two main sources. Copious amounts of fresh water from rivers like the Danube, Dnieper, and Don, and saltier water from the Mediterranean. As we know, fresh water is lighter than salty water. This leads to a stratification process where the heavier salty water sinks to the bottom, while the lighter fresh water stays near the surface until they eventually mix. The river at the bottom of the Bosphorus is, in fact, extremely salty water, behaving distinctively compared to the water above it. This blend of circumstances creates a truly astonishing and unique underwater spectacle. Number 7. The Underwater Stonehenge Dry spells can be devastating for communities relying on rain but a recent drought unveiled an unexpected treasure, a Stonehenge-like monument rising from the mud. Officially named the Dolmen of Godal Pereiro, this ancient ruin was first documented by German archaeologist Hugo Obermeier in 1926. The site yielded various artifacts, including 11 axes, flint knives, ceramics, and copper tools. The actual monument consists of about 150 massive granite stones, believed to date back to around 5000 BC. Dolmens, although not rare in Europe, remain mysterious, with little known about their creators or purpose. Unfortunately, in 1963, dictator Francisco Franco's decision to flood the area during dam construction dealt a severe blow to the site. It was largely forgotten until a recent drought in Spain revealed the Spanish Stonehenge once more. This isn't the first time the dolmen has resurfaced. Similar droughts occurred three times before. Entrepreneurs with boats even organized sightseeing tours bringing attention to the archaeological marvel. However, for farmers facing the brunt of the drought, the site is little consolation. Meanwhile, archaeologists face a dilemma, should they relocate the stones before they're submerged again or let nature take its course? The mystery of the dolmen continues, intertwined with the challenges of preservation and nature's unpredictable rhythms. Number 8. The Sound of Icebergs 
The mysterious sounds from the ocean, particularly the eerie bloop, add another layer of intrigue, especially when linked to the underwater realm believed to be the prison of the Lovecraftian monster-like god, Thuldu. First recorded in the 1990s during a search for underwater volcanic activity in the Pacific, the bloop remains a puzzle that divides scientists. While some attribute it to the cracking of icebergs, skepticism lingers. The accidental discovery unfolded as experts employed hydrophones, underwater microphones, to monitor the Pacific. The bloop, a peculiar noise like nothing heard before, was captured by different hydrophones situated more than 3,219 kilometers apart. Astonishingly, it is likely the loudest naturally occurring sound ever recorded by humans, yet its origin remains elusive. Some scientists suggest the sound's components resemble the way living organisms vocalize. However, even the largest whales, including the immense blue whale, lack the capability to produce such a thunderous noise. So, what could be the source? Are we dealing with a colossal creature lurking on the ocean floor, unseen and unheard? Is it the Kraken or something even more colossal? The mystery persists, inviting theories and sparking the imagination. What are your thoughts on this enigmatic underwater bloop? Number 9. The Mariana Trench Did you know the Mariana Trench is the deepest part of the ocean? The lowest spot, called Challenger Deep, is about 11,000 kilometers deep. To give you an idea, if you put the Himalayas, Earth's tallest mountain, into Challenger Deep, Mount Everest would still be more than a mile below sea level. But why haven't we explored it more? Picture this. The pressure down there is a whopping 1,000 times higher than normal. It's like having a headache with 1,000 elephants standing on your head. That's what you'd feel at the ocean's bottom. And let's not forget the sea monsters, with giant squids being just one example. To tackle this, we've sent autonomous submersible robots. What they found is even scarier, mysterious sounds that no one can explain. Some blame aliens, others say it's whales. Experts believe whales can make unknown sounds, for instance, sperm whales might create a sonic boom to stun prey, making it easier to catch. Some think this sound could stop a human heart, though no one's seen it and lived to tell. With 70% of our oceans unexplored, it's no surprise that terrifying secrets may be waiting, especially in the depths of the Mariana Trench. Number 10. The Kiss of Death The sarcastic fring head is indeed a peculiar creature, and the name itself might sound like a prank, but the reality is even stranger. Picture this. Imagine the gaping jaws of the sarcastic fring head, and the first thing that might come to mind is the acid-spitting dinosaur from Jurassic Park. It doesn't have the scream or the burning acid, but the display of ferocity is striking. These fish inhabit the waters off the North American coast of the Pacific and are typically less than 10 inches long. While they may not seem impressive while peeking from their underground hideouts, their true nature is revealed when they emerge. Extremely territorial, they fearlessly confront intruders, even those much larger than themselves. Armed with needle-like, razor-sharp teeth, they use this arsenal to both catch prey and defend their turf. When threatened, their defense tactics escalate. Initially, they rhythmically open and close their mouths to deter passersby. If this doesn't suffice, they take it up a notch by widening their jaws as much as possible, creating an illusion of a size several times larger than reality. In a bizarre twist, they engage in mouth-to-mouth -mouth wrestling with each other, fiercely competing for territory. Nature, indeed, can be both awe-inspiring and a bit scary in its creations. Join me next time as we delve into more exciting discoveries. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to stay updated on the latest oceanic wonders.